Sanin is a young entrepreneur from Croatia's capital Zagreb. Six years ago his life was turned upside down when he was diagnosed with a severe chronic liver disease. His health deteriorated and he found himself on the waiting list for a liver transplant. Luckily for him, Croatia is a world leader in transplant surgery and just eight days later a suitable organ was available. The thing I remember the most are those lights in the transport hall when they wheeled me in. I just looked at the ceiling and saw the lights just turning on and off when they took me through. Later, when I was transferred, I was asked to lie down on the operating table. After that, they put me to sleep and I don't remember anything until they woke me up in the recovery room. Sanin was one of the hundreds of transplant surgeries performed in Croatia every year. What was a routine operation for doctors was a new chance at life for him. He's able to go on just as before with daily immunosuppressant drugs, the only reminder of his surgery. I live a normal life. I go to work, I travel, I hang out. I just need to make sure I have enough medication and that I am responsible. There are five hospitals in Croatia that perform transplants, including the University Hospital Center in Zagreb. Since the first heart transplant was carried out there in 1988, Croatian doctors have performed the difficult procedure on more than 300 patients. Organ transplantation is a highly specialized medical field and doctors involved follow a rigorous schedule. We have standard working hours, but all of us doctors, interns, surgeons, anaesthetists are on standby. If it occurs, and it occurs a lot, that an organ become available at another hospital, then the team is on alert and performs a transplant. According to Croatian law, an organ is donated automatically unless the family of the donor explicitly objects. Croatia's default opt-in donor system means organs are more readily available than in countries that require individuals to go out of their way to register as donors. In Croatia, there are over 24 explant centers, which means that in 24 hospitals, potential donors are identified. Once brain death is confirmed, we go and talk to the family. Croatian citizens are altruistic, they are willing to donate their loved one's organs. And because of that, we have a large pool of organs that therefore make a large number of transplants. In Croatia, with the world-leading system in place, patients like Sanin can rest easy, knowing that they are in the best hands possible. Mirna Brekalo, TRT World, Zagreb, Croatia.